Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest n K in existence. And look, a lot of NBA 2K24 news just dropped. They saying cross play is 100% leaked, confirmed. A gameplay trailer drop. I seen it with my own eyes, okay? It's looking like the city's returning. And there's a lot of other stuff. They talking about the gameplay, all type of stuff, the pre-orders. I'm gonna go over all of that. So you wanna wanna watch this full video. Make sure you subscribe with post notice. You see when I uploaded this, okay? As soon as it drop, whenever I get a chance, cause I'm a busy man, I'ma upload it. Way quicker than every other YouTuber, my boy. But yeah, make sure y'all hit that like button. It helps young swan grow. And let's get right into it, man. Look at this. Well, I can't show you this, okay? They made like an article. It's gonna come out later. Basically they say features and details revamped interior defense and dribble combos experience next level gameplay and lifelike visuals as you compete as your favorite nba and wnba teams leak 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 showcase your deep arsenal of moves with revamped interior defense okay they're saying revamped interior defense y'all know that it defense is never going to be good a 2k dev literally admitted the game is meant for casuals now and it will not be skill based in any way it will not get harder they will not put defense in the game and it will be straight offensive heavy defense will never be good that's horrible i want 2k 16 type defense they're appealing to the wrong casuals you know um but that interior defense that i don't even think it's gonna ever be anything now they say new dribble combo controls for more rewarding skill-based actions and effectiveness oh it sounds so beautiful please enjoy pure authentic action with up-to-date rosters and historic teams bringing you even closer to the game unlike ever before so i guess they're adding a bunch of new teams i heard they're putting in like the 2010 lakers y'all let me know how y'all feel about that and um i mean they're saying like you know 2k be making it sound good all the time bro but they saying they changing the dribble system just to change the dribble system is a w but it's really the adrenaline every 2k with adrenaline is just the worst in like 2k ever. bottom tier now here is some old gen my career info i can't show y'all this okay but they say take control of your legacy in my career and ascend from generational talent to a hall of famer as you chase greatness and championships along the way step up your game with your my player in a picture squee what neighborhood okay this might mean the neighborhood returns or they just use this word okay who really know never know it's who can and they saying like pc so like a lot of pc people are very mad that PC is gonna get last gen again. Um, I don't know why they do this because both gens get like the same rewards too. So like I know PC guys can like leak the rewards, but it's like, what are y'all doing? Uh, two Ks filled with streamlined quests as you rise to the top. So they gonna have a bunch of quests. Hopefully it's not like last year where you gotta do a bunch of quests before you play my career. 2k is like tripping bro let people grind their builds it needs to be six times easier 10 times easier to grind your build bro people who play my career they gonna have fun either way maybe give them an extra grind where they can even transcend their 99 overall ability bro but everyone else they just want to get their build done go play they be tripping man a lot of people don't be making builds because of simply how long it takes to grind so 2k is literally robbing themselves of money by having grinding your build so like long it's so out of touch bro young ronnie tweeted out good night nba 2k 24 crew more to come tomorrow hey why is he saying nba 2k 24 crew leak 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 <laughs> Would y'all like the uh, crew modes to return from them old 2Ks? A lot of y'all probably, y'all y'all probably not hit, man. I think maybe something, I think this could be an indication of something like 2K19. If y'all didn't know like how they had like that crew thing, when you could like pull up on people in the park, it was messed up and did like poorly. You know, they, they execute everything so horribly, bro. But um, it could possibly be that or maybe something of the old i think it was 2k12 or it could just be nothing <laughs> now look if you want to see this trailer 
It's like they released it in the Japanese and stuff. You don't have to go to my Twitter, bro. Z Swan TZ, baby. I cannot post it. They will Hall of Fame striker me, my boy. 2K does not mess with me, bro. <laughs> I am like the only one that, you know, be really flaming them. You feel me? That really got a valid voice. You know, I'm like the leader of the creators, man. I say what they're too scared to say. You know, I influence creators. You know, that's a great influence. You feel me? Not just casuals like most creators. I influence the creators but um i'ma just repeat to you what it says bro okay so some some dude screaming cross plays coming to 2k he's screaming it he running around right riding a bike little dirk in that hole he's screaming cross play coming to 2k people saying you can't hide no more no more hiding you know xbox playstation wars who y'all think got better 2k players overall i believe over Overall, PlayStation players are better, but I think in the comp scene, Xbox players are better, man. Just because they play really weird. They're willing to go the extra mile, you know? Like, they're willing to, uh, in a 3v3 game, have two people rap and one person cut type stuff. <laughs> you know, they're just running around screaming, cross-play coming to NBA 2K, and they say it's only next-gen. They say it's only for the next gen, my boy. Then he's screaming on top of a mountain with the text saying crossplay is coming to new gen. Only new gen, not current gen. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about that. Y'all think that's gonna push more people to the new gen? I, I think I think this is a I see, I'm not too excited because I don't I don't know what this means. It can mean anything. Play now, my team. It it, it can mean anything, bro. They they already got crossplay features with the uh my team i don't know bro like <laughs> i'm so scorned from 2k bro i gotta like really see it there's more news you know maybe they say it in the other news i got it all logged up but it's like i don't know bro <laughs> maybe they like directly say it you know i ain't but then he's screaming on top of a building and it looked like you know the city is returning for new gen okay it really do look like the city too because Y'all let me know how y'all feel about the city. Man, they saying crossplay is only for the new gen. Is this gonna make y'all get a next gen system or are you gonna stay on current gen? Let me know. Be honest, it's okay. Th I think this is the first year that next gen wasn't better than the current gen version. I really wish they would just make one game, bro. So we already went over the Mamba moments. They're basically gonna be uh, replicating like uh, the Jordan thing it's gonna be like Kobe's best moments. They're gonna be go over, over that I'm leaking to y'all exclusive news before it gets released. We already went over that last They saying the neighborhood is returning to old gen in NBA 2k24. So I guess the uh, 18 through 20 is returning and it's not gonna have a city <sighs> Y'all think that's gonna make more people uh, play current gen y'all think man what y'all think? Okay, so for the My Team information that will be coming out later, uh, My Team features a collection of innovative improvements, including all, an all new salary cap mode while maintaining its signature competitive. Double H tweeted out WRL rebirth should be unlocked at 99 overall. Once you unlock it, all your builds made afterwards will have max badges and all overall cap breakers unlocked. This is a very W idea, okay? This would basically mean once you get the rebirth feature, you could just make every build and not have to grind your build no more. This is a W, bro, okay? Hopefully 2K does this. Then he says, this idea could make 2K more money because players know they don't have to redo the grind on a new build, encouraging them to spend VC on another build, encourage players to play longer for that 99 overall, encourage players to make more builds exactly but 2k is so out of touch bro i genuinely think they don't have confidence in their product bro i, I think the why they won't do something like this because it makes perfect sense i don't think they have confidence in their product and i think people grinding my career helps uh like users played like from like day to day and it's like the hours they spend grinding their build probably don't compare to how long they'll play because maybe they get frustrated or something. And they, I don't know. I doubt they can even see that far. But that's the only thing I could think. But I genuinely just think they're out of touch. That's the only benefit of the doubt, bro. Uh, I don't know, man.
Things 2K could add as leaderboards. Rep, win streaks, points, assists, rebounds, win percent, games play, wins, pro-am, park, stage, rec, BC game, events won, and wins for the day. They could do all types of stuff like that. Even in the older 2Ks, uh, it was filled with, like, real players. Like, of course, they were boosting, but it was, like, low-key, like, boosting, you know? But, um... It wasn't like just crazy boosting, just destroying every leaderboard. It's cool to have leaderboards in the game. But yeah, man, y'all check out my other 2K24 videos, especially when I'm talking about the 2K devs. It's a lot of information you want to hear. Y'all make sure y'all go watch this. But hey, <laughs> hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down, yo, off the top of the dome, dome.